Okay, you guys, I am so big. I just got in this house, y'all. What time is it, mama? Me and mama left the house. I six something this morning, mommy and I. And I promise you, what time is it, mom? She's gonna check to see what time it is. We exercise first. And then it was just like, okay, so why don't we just keep going? Didn't even eat breakfast. I don't know what we were thinking. And so now we have this haul. I'm not even gonna hold you guys longer because this video is probably even going to be a little longer. Or maybe I'll do this video in part two. This is part two of this video, y'all. All right, now, about to make one of these right now to see if I like them, but they're the veggie burgers. Sweet potato and sunflower seed sounds really, really good. So I can't wait to try that. And I'm gonna do just that. Well, at least try to attempt to. I'm gonna have a veggie burger and a salad. Okay, next we have here is um, some blueberries. We have some blackberries. Come find out these are not even organic, but child, we gonna pray over these in the name of Jesus. They gonna be okay. Okay, and then down in here, they were doing samples, y'all. They were so delicious. But yes, um, Idell's Variety Pack Caramelized caramelized onion, sweet and sour, spicy mac. Y'all, that spicy jalapeno, I'm all over that one. We went back to go. You know how you be walking around and your food get cold? So, Mom and I went back to go try to change it. Y'all, it was only two of those left. And it was, like, at least more when we grabbed them. So, it was only two. Right when we were leaving, this lady... Um, we're doing a sample for this late July sea salt multi-grain tortilla chips. And, uh, y'all excuse the bags down there. I have so many bags. And, um, we tried them and absolutely loved them. So mom and I got these for when we have, you know, if we're making, um, turkey tacos or turkey nachos, we can have these with them. So that's good. Here, put that on the shelf. Next thing we got here, sardines. These were on sale. Sardines are so good. We're a sardine family. I know everybody does not like sardines, but we do. We usually get them from Trader Joe's, but this was a pretty good deal. Y'all, I'm so sorry I don't have the prices. I think I showed them in the video. But yeah, this was, I think, around six bucks. They were regular nine, and I got them on sale. Then we got our syrup, because on the weekend when we want to have our pancakes, we have our syrup here. You guys... I can let me tell you this is one of the staples in my cooking I don't go crazy with it but I have to have it it is such a good flavor and I cannot believe this was in in there for six bucks mom and they have small ones in the grocery store that are five bucks so I said are you kidding me so yeah got that and then we got the cookies the Belgian cookies I'm so excited I might even leave them in here because we're gonna um, have these until uh, well let me take them out just to see what one says on the Back. But anyway, that's the Belgian cookies. I was looking for the macaroons, you guys, and they did not have the macaroons. So you might have them in your area. You guys go check in your grocery store. I mean, at your Costco. I'm going to link the video down below so you can see which heart macaroons I'm speaking of. They will be in the description box below, and you can look at the video to see if you even are interested. But they were so delicious and so cute. Perfect for Valentine's Day. So I'm going to link that below. Didn't see it. I'm going to try another Costco to see if they have them. But they did say it was going to come out on the 10th. So that gives us a little bit of time being that this is still January so I'm just gonna just check periodically back and forth just to see you know hopefully they get them different Costco so this one is the European cookies with Belgian um, chocolate oh my gosh and their heart I thought they were so cute you guys regular $9.99 and I got them for five bucks but these are what comes in this um, set that I'm not gonna read it I'm just going to show you and you can read it. Hopefully I'm not going too fast. Pause your camera. I mean, pause your video. Yes. So that is what comes in this set. This, I always like to get these cookies because if you ever decide to do, like I had, had did a charcuterie board. I'm hoping I'm saying that right now. Cheese board. I add some cookies from Trader Joe's and they are, they were a hit. And these are just beautiful if you ever decide to do that. Like I said, dinner guests coming over. You don't have to put fuss about a dessert in the kitchen, honey. You can go ahead on. If you're not buying something from a bakery, you can go ahead on and get these cookies. And they will be a hit with some coffee. 
there you go okay so that's all the cookies that come in this huge container let me tell you i'm going it's three pounds i'm going to take this to work around um valentine's day because i know that they're going to be gone so that was really a good deal so you guys go check that out these are called heavenly chunks heavenly hunks and these are good i thought when we go hiking and just need some extra energy just take a couple of these plop them in your mouth or if you're just like needing some energy and you're out and about like we were just now you can just take a couple of these and just hey you got some energy and this is the antioxidant and it is the live more organics i have a uh new blender coming soon i'm going to show you guys i'm really excited about sharing that and i'm going to actually do a um maybe this one that sounds good maybe we'll try that all right so you guys stay tuned for that but yeah this is the antioxidant blend okay next thing we have here that needs to go in I saw this and was like, oh my gosh. Okay, I have got to try this. So we got the brown rice with green asparagus, zucchini, and dehydrated vegetables. I thought this looked so delicious, right? Just looks delicious. I mean, when you don't feel like, you know, just plain brown rice, and it's only 50 milligrams of sodium, and I'm just, uh, that just looks so good. I'm so excited about trying this. This will be good with salmon. This will be good with baked chicken. This will be good with just a veggie burger on the side. And you want a little bit of the rice if you want without bread. The veggie burger without bread with a little bit of this on the side. I mean, just perfect. And so, I'm so excited. And I will let you know, those of you who are interested, what this tastes like. And this is by this brand. There we go. <laughs> Next thing I got was some ground turmeric. Because we should never, because turmeric, I mean, it's turmeric. We always want want some turmeric so yeah I want to try some turmeric milk though so yeah I got this for a really good price so I went ahead on and got some turmeric and then we got the Central Coast raw unfiltered honey this is for many different recipes and also if you want to put a little bit of honey in your tea you guys this is so cute um this is look what I got from Walmart y'all my mom was like when are you gonna cook them cookies because you know we on a diet we ain't gonna be eating them cookies so i said child please cook some cookies i like to cook cookies and give them away to people i'm always doing that but these little cookies y'all you guys check this out these little cookies were a dollar and like 25 24 cents at walmart and this is the dip chocolate cookie kit mind you did i say it was a kit and then the next one we have here is a cute brownie so I got two of the brownies, cause that's just too cute. I can take that to work. We got these cute little shortbread ones. And they were all on sale for a dollar. First it said two twenty four, but when I went back up there, I mean, as he scanned, it went down to one twenty four. So she was like, oh, that is so cute. I'm always liking to bake little things. If I don't feel like doing things from scratch, bake and then um, give them away. So what's the next thing we have here? I did get a cute little tablecloth here adorable from um walmart i got a bumblebee organic bumblebee albacore tuna yes i got some wash y'all i like to wash my feet with these because they have like that rough and uh, i'm just weird i'm so weird let me tell you what i do i am so weird if i walk around the house barefoot i can never sit on a sofa and just put my feet up if I don't, even if I have socks on, they have to be in a house shoe. And even if I'm wearing a house shoe, before I put the house shoe on, okay, let me get it right. Y'all listen to me. If I'm walking around barefoot, I can't sit on a sofa and just put my feet up. I Even if my floor is clean, I have to have a towel with soap to wash my feet before I put them up on the sofa. <laughs> And my mom and Josh think I'm crazy. When I come off of the sofa to get up and do something, the only way that I can come back and be comfortable with my um, uh, feet going up on the couch is if I put them in a pair of house shoes that only go, th that every time I use my house shoes, I have to wash my feet. So I don't know. And I've always been like that, y'all. So that is what I have these for. And also, the white ones, if you can get an all-white comb, they're good to exfoliate your face, too. And your body. These little things are good to exfoliate your body. So, yeah, I got that. So, Mommy is real particular about the paper towel because we use... What is the other brand you use? Brownie yeah, well, and... Brownie and... Uh, Brownie Scott. and Scott. So, if you pull off Brownie and Scott for some simple situations, Mommy is going to be real hot. <laughs> so, 
she wants she she goes and buy these Walmart ones because she said use these for the simple situations meaning something simple don't wipe your mouth with my brownie that's supposed to help me get that water up real good off that <laughs> countertop <laughs> so she gets these simple ones y'all she is so funny so yeah these are 88 and this is what we use if we have to no, grab a paper towel cents. real quick oh they're 49 cents so yes that's what she gets mm -hmm. mommy is so funny and you guys okay, another thing she does let me tell you another thing that she does we don't have our own washer and dryer in our apartment complex. We've had apartments, uh, lived in an apartment before where we had our own washer and dryer. This apartment is older and does not offer that. Some do, but this one doesn't. So they just remodeled the um, washroom, but it doesn't matter. My mother takes, what is it you take? I make there? me a solution. She with makes pine a solution and water. with pine saw and water. And is it in called? In a spray bottle. In a spray bottle, y'all. And she takes one of these, let me show y'all. She takes a couple of these down to the washroom and I have gone down there with her and done it too. Okay, we've done that. This is what she does. And it, you know what, and I'm used to it now. I can't do it without it. We clean each washer before we use it. So we're spraying and we're wiping and cleaning all in the inside, all on the outside. And y'all would not believe what we find in these washers. It is so much hair and animal hair mm -hmm. and all kinds of different hairs that if you just plop your clothes in, your clothes, yeah. your clothes is taking up that hair. Mm -hmm. So that's what we do. <laughs> we're so crazy. And we do it to the dryer too. Yes, we do. We, washing in this family takes about what? <laughs> uh, the cleaning part takes about a good 20 minutes. Takes about a good 20 minutes, yeah. 20 to 25 I mean, minutes. You know, but hey, you gotta you do what you gotta do. Until you get your own washer dryer. Yeah, until you get your own washer and dryer. And those of you who are blessed with a washer and dryer, y'all better thank, thank the mighty God, God that you have day. your own washer and dryer. Because let me tell you, sharing a washer and dryer with people that are not your family, it is not cool. Mm -hmm. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah. So anyway, the next thing we have here. I thank God for my washer and dryer. She does. Every day because she it's said because she knows it's coming. Okay, so we have this. And then what else? Okay, what else do we get from Dollar Tree? Oh, mommy is still old school. She bought the palm olive. Mm hmm. She's still old school. And my glad. And she gets her glad. Mommy stays old school and simple, and my I'm not mad booster. at that. And she does her game booster. She still does that. <laughs> and she gets these all from the That's Dollar Tree. And y'all, she loves this from the Dollar bath. Tree. It's a bubble bath. Is this the one that really bubbles up? Yeah, it bubbles up. Let good. me tell y'all. I use a, if I use bubble bath, I, it has to be um, of really, really good ingredients because my skin is real sensitive. And, uh, but this one, I've tried this one. Let me tell y'all, it stays bubbly to the end of your bath. You still have a load of bubbles in there. It really does help with cleaning out the tub when you get out and you want to do, you know, clean your tub. It does help. Um, to clean out the tub and you just add extra whatever you need to clean the rest of the tub out But yes, and it does smell good. So that's that that's what we got from the Dollar Tree and y'all she got all, my mother is addicted to these plastic containers So we have these Easy sealed tiny little storage and I do like these myself because you can put little salad dressings in there a small amount of Nuts for your salad. You can put a, a small amount of berries in here. I take these to work with me and put blueberries and raspberries and strawberries cut up and it does help assist. I have to say that does help. The next one she has here is this size. Um, you can put, Betty Crock and Delta yeah, and these are all Betty Crocker. So I'm just going to show you the different sizes that she has. And then she has this size. Y'all, she loves these things. Okay. Leftovers. And Lord, if you take, if you take it, she don't you forget to get I'm child day a dollar at the store. <laughs> don't you forget to but give you don't my get them off of No, them she don't. It's, it's but these I've even used these when I make cookies. I'll put them inside and just put some um parchment paper in between each layer and they freeze very well in the freezer. So I can say I do like this size. And then I've also used this as well. You guys have probably even seen me use these um on my um cookie videos. So yeah, I have used these. So they do work work well I have to agree with mm -hmm. that so now for the Valentine stuff y'all okay so the first sign that I have here how cute is that not adorable 
That is the cutest Dollar Tree saw. And mommy loves her red truck. So that says love is all you need. And that is so cute. And I love this one. It just reminds me of Perry, that little bike. Isn't that cute? They are so adorable and they are plywood. And they're just too cute. And you can just hang these around in your house and you can use these for years to come. I don't think you should get rid of these. A lot of people are like, oh, that was old last year. Child, uh -huh. use these year round. Put these in your, in your little, um, in your, um, wherever you store your, um, decorations and how you label them. Valentine, honey, add this to the Valentine collection. I'm too through. Look at this. I'm too through. This is so cute. Is that not the cutest thing ever? So adorable. Okay, and then the next thing we got for Valentine, y'all, I was in there just picking out flowers. And I'm gonna take a florist class, but yeah, we got a garland here. I got one from Michael's last year, but I cannot find it. So we're gonna use this one. We're gonna double it up and use this garland. I know it's in storage. Okay, so we're gonna put that, and I love the red and, and the green one together. Is for your job. Yeah, I'm gonna put one on my, on my desk at work because people like when I decorate. And then the, we got the pink ones. All the pink flowers. Yes, I do. I do. Where's the prenup? I do. <laughs> he didn't sign the prenup. Is it sign the prenup or don't sign the prenup? Don't sign I do. Prenup. He didn't sign the prenup, so I do. No, just kidding. <laughs> Y'all, I'm done. All right, so here we go. The next thing, I'm not that kind of chick, so just that, that was just a joke. This is what I'm going to put on my desk at work. And I just thought it was so pretty, just so darling. And I'm going to leave it there because you know what? It looks like it'll fit good year round. It's just really, really pretty. We like, mommy like putting, <laughs> we put a Christmas, up. matter of fact, the Christmas one is still over there on the door, girl. We ain't moved it. Uh, she likes putting bells on the doors, but this one is so cute. Is it not? Look at that. It is so cute. Only thing is we have a problem if everybody's in bed at night and we hear that bell ring. <laughs> You so don't mind me, but yes, yes, this is adorable. All a dollar at Dollar Tree. This, this is a Christmas, Christmas one. I have to take it that off we got so last year. How cute we got that last year? Maybe even two years ago. Yeah, so. really, really That's cute. Old. And then let me show you what I got from Target last night. You guys, I said these people, they have been out all day. Yes. Listen, I am not that kind of woman that can sit up and just shop just all day. I can't do it. Kick. Oh yeah, I did go by Ralph and get a salad kick because we're about to make a salad right now and have a, a veggie burger. I'm gonna put a little bit of raisins in my salad because I like it a little bit. And then we just got the cheese. I know this cheese is not good for you, but it makes the best grilled cheese sandwiches. And we got some bananas. Banana. Gonna eat a banana because it's good for potassium in your muscles. Okay, so the next thing we have here, and then this is it. Okay, you guys, last night got this from Michaels. How cute is he? How cute is he? I love German Shepherds, and you never see German Shepherds on anything. And when I saw this, I thought, a German Shepherd saved my life, so that's another reason why I love them so yes, much. Is. It is This dog is one of the most amazing dogs. They truly are gentle and loving and very protective over their families, but they're very gentle with children. Let me tell you, that dog that saved my life could not stand me. He would chase me around the corner. He lived with me. He was my dog, Max. Um, my stepfather's dog, actually. That dog chased me around the corner every single day, y'all. But when I had an incident happen to me, that dog saved my life. He had since he was wise enough. That's when I knew they were really smart because he knew like, even though we're going through this right now, you're going through this. I'm going to save you because you're my family and I'm not going to let them hurt you. So, oh my gosh, that is why I love dogs. German Shepherd. That's why I love German Shepherd so much. And when I do get a chance to get enough money, I'm going to get me a German Shepherd or a couple. And you can come to my house if you want to without being announced. You can you can come to my house, Dallas and Austin will get you. <laughs> but anyway, these are just he is just so cute. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Okay, and then the next one we have here are these adorable coffee mugs that I saw at Target last night. And it says, I love you and I love you more. And this is really cute just for you to use on your own. 
or if you have a honey and on the morning of um, Valentine's Day you make a nice breakfast for your honey and you can pull one of these uh, each out for you guys to have a nice um, cup of coffee or a cappuccino or a frappuccino or whatever you want to call it and just enjoy your honey bunny or yourself treat yourself because even if you don't have anybody love yourself ladies you don't need nobody to love you love yourself it's nice to be loved but love yourself okay next thing here we have i thought this was so cute and i just had to get it okay then we're almost done you guys okay this cute little spatula with the wood handle i'm done she's done okay i'm done look at the hearts so cute with the wood handle i'm done she's done and then the next one was this cute whisk I just cannot. And these are both a dollar, y'all. That dollar section, let me tell you. That dollar section is amazing. But let me tell you something. I'm going to be honest with you. I love you, housewives. Y'all, I respect your job more than any job ever, especially when you're working it. You raising your babies at home, honey, that is the hardest job in the world. But y'all got to give us a break on these dollar sections at Target. Y'all go swipe out everything. <laughs> By the time we get off work and come, we're like, oh, I remember my friend said at work the other, she's like those housewives, they take up everything. And I was like, hey, they got to make their environment pretty too. They want to make their homes pretty so their kids can feel festive. I understand. I'm not beating you down, but just leave a little, mate. You know, just leave a little for us too. Okay. And look, y'all, look at this picture. Oh my gosh. Look at this picture. Oh my gosh. $5 glass. And it is so heavy, and it's a spout on at the end. Look at the spout. Look at the spout. I'm, I'm just so happy. I got to hit this. I'm so happy about this glass. Can y'all see that glass? Can y'all see that glass? That is absolutely beautiful. And baby, listen, y'all hear that? That is glass so pretty i think this would this is just so cute like when they like say for instance you're doing a galentine's right and your girlfriends are all you guys are all coming over and you're you're hosting a galentine's you get like at least about you have a long table everything is so festive and so pretty and girly and valentiney because you love your girls you have like a bunch of these down like maybe not a bunch however long the table is you maybe have three or four of these and they have different drinks in them i don't drink but I'm talking about it could be non-alcoholic or alcoholic, whatever you're choosing. And you could just really put fruit in here. Can you imagine some strawberries in here? Um, raspberries and you have some type of concoction going on in there or some type of drink. How pretty is that? Absolutely gorgeous. I love the fact that it's clear. So that's just a great idea for those of you who are going to do a Galentine for your girlfriends. Okay, you guys. I forgot to show you. Um, Mom and I went to Michael's and they had these bracelets on sale buy one get one 50% off and mommy chose these two So I got these for her. It's just a, a cuz you're my mommy gift <laughs> If I have anything in my teeth, I'm so sorry y'all just had some orange and um, I'm trying to eat a lot of vitamin C So this is what that one looks like and it's really really pretty Isn't that beautiful? So pretty, it's like pearlesque like. And these are called the completed bracelets, okay? Yeah, she chose this really pretty green one. And it fits her arm so nicely. Pretty pearl one. And they were buy one, get one free. Isn't that pretty? So pretty. I love buying my mommy cute little stuff. So there we go. Okay, you guys, I'm tired. She probably even forgot some stuff. I remember anything I remember I I'll show you everything. you think I got everything mommy says she think I got everything y'all I'm so beat I am not listen I'm an online shopper if it don't fit send it back I cannot do this being in the mall or being in the store all day but one thing I can't say getting up early when I'm off I love that and going shopping because it is hardly no one in the stores and I do appreciate that today I became one of those housewives because I went I'm not criticizing y'all. I do not want you thinking I'm criticizing you. I just want you to leave a little something. So when we come to the dollar section in the evening time, we can have some of the pretty Valentine or Easter or Christmas stuff too. All right, you guys. So thank you so much for tuning in to Journey with Shar. And I hope you enjoy this uh, haul and going out shopping with Shar and mom. And you guys be blessed and have a lovely weekend coming soon. Be safe. Drive safe. And uh, thank you so much. You guys, 
And those of you who are new to my channel, welcome. I do appreciate you. And I do have a surprise. I'm going to keep saying this until it comes up. I have a surprise. And I'm so excited. And I do have a haul that a lot of you pioneer people are going to be very, very happy about. Well, at least I hope you do because I'm happy. Um, it's a nice pioneer woman haul coming up. And it's a nice... Um, something special coming up so you guys stay tuned for that so i'm so tired i'm taking that you guys be blessed i'll see you soon remember trust god keep him first and he'll always lead you in the right direction and always remember be kind it's important to be kind even when you don't want to choose to be kind i'll see you soon you guys be blessed